If the church is God's primary mission strategy in the world, and I think theologically that is irrefutably the case, uh, I'm happy to uh, talk about that in more detail at some point in the future, um, but if that is the case, then church planting is uh, the principal means by which God is going to spread the gospel around the globe, and historically that has been the case. Um, but it's important that we, we, we're unambiguous in our assertion that church planting is a gospel initiative. That is, that it is all about the gospel. Um, it isn't about us putting on a better service than the church down the road. It isn't about us being trendier. It isn't about us being able to do what we want to do. The only legitimacy for church planting is that it's a gospel initiative. It's a way of getting the good news of Jesus out to the world. It's a way of, of, of establishing new communities that model the reign of King Jesus. Uh, those communities that we can point to and say, this is what it means to live, live under the reign of King Jesus. Um, and as we, as we live those lives, then we, we, we provide a context in which people are going to ask us for the reason for the hope that lies within us. So church planting is first, foremost, uh, first and last, really, uh, a gospel initiative. And if we lose sight of that, then it becomes nothing other than a personal indulgence. And that we have to repent of.